Hello everybody, this is Andrew Roboto here and today I'd like to do some commentary slash reaction videos on some more Childish Dad videos by The Real Random Wazzy. And the first one I'm going to react to um, is the, the latest one that was released and, I've, and I haven't seen it yet. So this is going to be the first time I watch it and give my reaction to that video. It's called um, Childish Dad and the, Burglar, and the Burglars, which looks pretty interesting. And it's going to look pretty funny, too. <laughs> All right. So anyways, without further ado, let's react to the newest video that that I'm excited to watch and give my reaction to. Let's see what it has for us. Okay, Dave. Me and the kids are about to leave for our shopping trip. Now, are you sure that you don't want to come along? I'm sure. There's a Barney the Dinosaur Marathon on today, and I want to stay home and watch it. All right. Well, as we'll usual, he wants to watch Barney. As usual. Oh, I will. I'll be sitting on my butt all day watching Barney. Yay. Catherine and the kids are going to be off for a few hours. Now I finally get to relax with my Lord and Savior, Barney the Dinosaur. Your Lord and Savior. Come on, Mark. The goods must be around here somewhere. We just gotta check every room. Oh, no. I think there are burglars in the house. Well, I may just have a few tricks up my sleeve. I'll show those burglars, burglars? into our house. Oh, That's there's burglars. Okay. Ha, 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 ha. All right. Where's the money, Harry? This place sure does look like it has a lot of money. I recognize those two burglars. That's Harry. That's Marv. Harry and Marv. They're, they're two burglars from, or as they call themselves, the Wet Bandits in Home Alone One and Two, or in the second movie they call themselves the Sticky Bandits. They're burglars that go after Kevin, and, and Kevin has to defend himself using booby traps, in both um, his house in the first movie and then. His Uncle Rob's um, apartment in the second movie. Which those booby traps are just funny as hell. Because they're getting like all these injuries. <laughs> so yeah. So I recognize those guys. That's Harry and Marv. Gotta love the actors. Daniel Stern and Joe, Joe Pesci. They're both one of the funniest Home Alone actors. Well. I don't know, do I, you peanut brain idiot? That's why we are looking around the house to see where the money is exactly. Now, why don't you make yourself useful and help me? Oh man, we are going to be so rich. Shut up. <laughs> right. Time to mess with the two silly and stupid burglars. They have no idea what is about to befall them. Hey, hey, hey. Okay, now all we need to do is search all the rooms in the house until we find the cash and then we... What, Lee? Hello, my name is Dave, and what brings you to my humble home? Mark, you dimwit. You said that the house was going to be empty. Well, it's not empty. Well, guess what? The house is not empty because Dave is home. <laughs> well, I thought that it was. I don't know why that guy is still here. Ugh, just forget it. We gotta find what we came for. All right, listen up, you human gorilla. You better tell us what Human you gorilla. Cash, otherwise, we might kidnap you and have your family pay a hefty ransom. Yeah, show us where the money is. Unless you want to end up as a kidnapped victim. Oh no. Please, don't kidnap me. I don't want to be kidnapped. I'll give you what you want. In fact, I'll go and get you our hidden money right now. Wise choice, buddy. What Wise the? choice. Okay, is this some kind of... Hey, <laughs> Dave has a cannon! <laughs> Sorry, gentlemen, but you will not be getting any money from this house today. However, you will be getting cannonballs to your allergy areas. So, prepare yourselves. This is for breaking into my house. <laughs> oh my god, Harry and Marv got shot in the testicles with a cannonball. <laughs> so this reminds me of when Harry got shot with a BB gun. When Kevin shot Harry with a BB gun and Marv would have in the in the face with a BB gun. <laughs> hey! Get back here, you trickster. How dare you fire cannonballs at our forbidden areas? Ha 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 ha! I'm here. Come and get me. Uh -huh. Dave knows there how to defend himself so from these burglars. Just to us. Oh, come on. Don't take it personally, fellas. I'm only trying to protect my house, just like anyone else in a situation like this. By the way, quick question. Do the parrot you want to hear a really annoying sound? What kind of question is that? 
Of course yeah, we don't want to hear what anything. kind of question is that? We just want the cash in to get out of here. Yeah, so stop messing around and tell us where it is, or else you're coming with us and your family. We'll have to pay us for your safe return. Well, that's too bad, because you are going to hear an annoying sound, whether you like it or not. Hey, what the heck are you doing? Shut up. Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, annoying sounds. <laughs> uh, let's just forget about the cash mark. This guy is starting to get on my nerves. Let's just burgle another house on the street instead. Yeah, I agree with you, Harry. He is really annoying. Oh, man. You guys aren't leaving already, are you? I was starting to have fun with you both. Well, news flash buddy, but you've got to be the most annoying person that we have ever met, so you can keep your dumb cash, because we're going to... <laughs> yeah, well, that's what you get for trying to rob Dave's house. <laughs> exactly. We are going to find another house to briggle. Well, good luck with that. Not like you need it. Oh, by the way, before you go, allow me to introduce you to some friends of mine. Oh, oh my, my god. god. <laughs> attack, attack. Oh, no, 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 no. no. I stopped a pair of burglars from stealing our money. Good yeah. job, Dave, for stopping the burglars. <laughs> also known as the white slash sticky bandits, Harry and Mark themselves. Is it time to talk to your dog? <laughs> oh my god, that was funny. This is the first time David had offended himself from burglars. <laughs> Alright, so next video I'm going to react to. Let me scroll down on the list because... couple I haven't reacted to yet, but I'll s scroll down the list, see which ones I haven't done yet. Next one is going to be Childish Dad Gets Scared by Random Things. Well, there's a big scary... Oh, hang on. Sorry, I couldn't get the full screen up in time because the video started. Now we're going to start. Well, there's a big oh, there's a spider big spider. <laughs> oh, my God, I don't think I'm well. going <laughs> to not because the spider might eat me in my sleep water. I am a big scary oh, spider. And it sounds like a little demon water. Oh my god. Water. Oh no. 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 That plane is so big and menacing looking. That plane is so big and menacing looking. Yeah, that's real scary water. Oh my god. Dude, got a freaking grip? It's only a plane. Sheesh. Get a grip, Dave. It's uh, just a plan. Weirdo. La 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 What a wonderful day. It is today to be taking a walk randomly in a barn. Yeah. Oh, God. That cow is seriously giving me the creeps. It's almost like... Wow. Dave is scared of a cow. <coughs> Boo. Well, wow. Yeah, Dave is scared of a cow. Wow. So scary. Well, oh, my God. It was so scary inside the toilet and it smelled... <laughs> Dave just literally forced himself down a toilet. <laughs> oh my god. What a badass. Dave, you are such a bad, a total badass and a savage. <laughs> oh no. I am huge and it really scares me. Well, no, duh, Dave. You're a big beefcake. <laughs> The moon does not look that scary. It's just huge in the Beyond universe. With the angry face, a great moon. Please do not hurt me, for I am just a man, and I have a moon can't hurt you. It just it just makes the sky dark. That reminds me of the meme where um the latest meme I saw where if the solar system was close to the Earth, and one of the pictures I've noticed was Saturn like almost touching the ground. Here, what's why did I have to run up from my family like the stupid idiot that I am? Wow, man, which way do I go? I gotta fix There's the so brightness from, and I don't even know which is the right path to take. Well, hello there, my good sir. Oh, it's a butterfly. A lost. Who is who is that butterfly? Maybe who I is it? Help you out there. What do you say? What's the name of that butterfly, anyways? Let me know in the comments because I know. I know the, that was one of the old profile pictures the real random Wazi had, but I can't remember the name of it. One. Okay, guess that's a no then. Well, never mind. This is my comeback. 
Well, never mind then. Alright, next video we're going to be reacting to is Childish Dad at a Fancy Restaurant. Okay. That's the next one. Which, as soon as the ad will stop playing, we'll get to it. Oops. Sorry. It sure is nice to get out of the house for a couple of hours and have a nice meal. Let me just adjust the brightness. I do apologize. Yes, Mum. I do agree with you 100%. It's a little bright, yeah. so bear with me. I've never been to a fancy restaurant before, so this could be quite exciting. Man, this is so boring. Oh, don't start, Dave. Can't we have one day without you acting up for once? I just want a nice family meal at this fancy restaurant. Is that too much to ask? But Catherine, I didn't want to come to this boring shithole. I wanted to <laughs> have a boring shithole. Nice. Watch your language. We are in the fancy restaurant, and I don't think all the posh people here will approve of your foul language, mister. I don't think they would approve of it either, buddy. Good day and welcome to this extremely posh restaurant. Are you lovely folks? Oh, the posh restaurant, nice. Do you have chocolate milkshakes? Uh, no, we do not have that disgusting beverage here, sir. What do you think it is? I chocolate milkshakes are delicious. They are not disgusting. Clearly that waitress is an entitled Karen. Fast food restaurants and riffraff. Why? <laughs> Here comes the, the signature tantrum. Well, I must say that... I forgot to point this out in the first video I react to. That's one of the few videos where Dave does not... The f it's one of the f few videos where Dave does not throw t that the real random Mozzy uploaded that Dave does not throw a tantrum. Instead, he defends himself. Good on you, Dave. His behavior is extremely appalling. Never in all my life have I ever come across such a theatrical man that cries like a small child. I am really sorry about my husband's childish behavior. He tends to act like this quite a lot, but don't worry, I will try and keep him under control. Well, he does act like this a lot because, according to Dave, he was dropped on his head by his mother accidentally when he was a baby, and that slowed down his brain development. <laughs> Dave is standing on the table throwing a tantrum. Oh my god! <laughs> you are a huge embarrassment. <laughs> I have already told you that we do not serve chocolate milk. <laughs> I suggest you get down from the table right now. <laughs> no, you cannot tell me what to do. You are not my mommy. You are a second entitled Karen Water. Well, Dave is actually not wrong about that. She, did, The waitress is an entitled Karen. Damn. I fell off the table. Ooh, you fell off the table. Well, it serves you right for standing on the table and kicking up such a fuss over chocolate milk. That drink is not welcome in our very posh restaurant. We wow. We are terribly sorry about our embarrassment of a father. Total embarrassment, if you ask me. Behavior. That does not excuse this appalling behavior. I beg your pardon? Madam, this is a posh Yeah, I beg your pardon, ma'am. None of the posh people that come here want to see a grown man acting the way he does. Also, if he was my husband, well, I would have divorced him years ago. Or better yet, I would have had him locked away. Walked away and divorced years ago. Hmm. Wow. I'm not I'm not surprised she said that. Now you just listen here. My Dave may be a childish bag boom, and he may get on my nerves sometimes, but there is a reason why he acts the way he does, and I am not going to tell you because it is none of your business. But despite his childish attitude, he is still my husband and I am not locking him away. Well, I think you should. A person like that should... Well, you shouldn't lock anyway. your own husband away. I mean, the only way... I mean, the only way a husband and wife should be locked away is if... is in prison for murder. Especially in a posh place like this. Oh, shut up. You stuck up cow. I am <sighs> not going to stand here and let you talk shit about my husband. 
I want my chocolate milk water. Yeah, she's an entitled Don't parent. worry, Dave. We are leaving this snobbish hellhole and we will go to McDonald's <laughs> and, sit, and I will get you a chocolate milk from there. Yeah, that's well by by the way the the waitress is acting all entitled, it's clearly a snobbish a snobbish hell. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. I'm finally going to get a chocolate <laughs> nice. milk. Yay. And this for you. You have just lost four customers because we will never be coming back here again and be looked down on. Good. Because if Raft like Yeah, you just lost, lost four customers. Way to go, entitled Karen. Okay guys, let's leave the stump and Go for a McDonald's instead. Can I get with nice. you on my chocolate milk? That's if they have any, Dave. Hold up. I just need to do a little something before we go. And what do you want now? Hmm? Oh, I just wanted to leave a little something to remember us by. Ready? Here it comes. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, that was absolutely... Dave crazy. just farted in front of the waitress. <laughs> Oh my god. <laughs> well, you deserve that for being an entitled Karen. Serves you right. <laughs> he just farted in front of the waitress. Alright, so last video I'm going to be reacting to, which is, I think it's the next one. Is it? No way, it's not the next one. It's the one after that. Let me see where the next one is. Okay, so the next one. Gotta flip through this. This playlist and see which one. Uh, last one I want to react to. That's not that I haven't done yet. Um, where is it? Hang on, I think I gotta scroll up. Because I don't see it. Uh... Cause I know I've done almost all of these, but there's a, there's only a few left I haven't done yet, and I'm getting gonna try to get to those as as quick as I can. Oh yes, it is the next one. I was correct. Childish Dad refuses to take a nap. I don't know why I thought it was the video oh, after nice. that, but I was correct on that one. All right, here we go. Dinosaur from our imagination and what is told is what we call a dinosaur. Oh, he's singing the Barney theme Dave, song. Nice. My dumpling, it's time for your afternoon nap. <laughs> afternoon nap. Well, you, you might as well make him take it because he's a 35, he's, he's childish. 35 year old childish man. <laughs> oh, but Catherine, I don't want to take a nap. I want to watch Barney and friends. But Dave, sweetheart, you need to take a nap because all big strong men need to have their naps to make them bigger and stronger. That's an inside, that's clearly the inside joke of the video. <laughs> Wah, but Dave, do not start this again. Why is everything I try and get you to do always turn into some kind of challenge? Now, stop this nonsense. Everything is a challenge. It's time for your afternoon nap. No. Dave Johnny Johnson, if you do not come willingly to the bedroom, then I will just have to carry you up there myself. Please do well, carry him. That's what makes it funny. First. <laughs> <laughs> He's gonna have... Well, you'll have to catch him first. <laughs> hey! You can't do that. You can't just run off like that. Hey! You can't do that. <laughs> Another funny A new funny line from Catherine that I've heard of. Even Catherine has funny lines, not just Dave. <laughs> Get back here right now, mister. All right, Dave, come out here Dave's right now. Dave's hiding. I do not have time for your silly games. You are taking a nap and that is final. Dave's clearly I hiding. That husband of mine can be a real piece of work a lot of the time. No, well, ki no he's kidding, he's a piece of work. <laughs> I will find you, Dave, and when I do, I am carrying you up to bed and you are having your afternoon nap. Find <laughs> out loud almighty. Where the heck could he have got to? I swear that man is going to be the death of me. Dave Johnny Johnson, you get your beefcake self out here right now, mister. You are in some serious <laughs> trouble, I swear. He's hiding behind I'm the couch. <laughs> this is the time to play hide and seek. <laughs> I'm in no mood for games. Come on, Bran. When can I have a turn on the iPad? You've been playing it for too long now and I want to have a turn. Just be patient, Emma. You can have a turn once I have finished this level. I promise. Hey, Brian and Emma. Oh, hello, Mom. And what can we do for you? You kids haven't seen your father around, have you? He was the... 
He's upside down under the tree. How do you not notice? How do you and how does Brian and Emma not notice that? Supposed to be taking his afternoon <laughs> nap, but he's run off. He's and hiding no under the tree. He's upside down. Try looking under Brian's bed. He always goes to hide under there whenever he's in trouble. Of course, I should have checked that to begin with. He hides under <laughs> Brian's bed. Why can't Dave just go hide under his, his and his own bed? Why would why do you have to pick Brian's? <laughs> <laughs> That's honestly weird. All right, Dave. I am coming for you, and you are in so much trouble. <laughs> she will never find me under here. Dave. <laughs> Dave's here. hiding under the bed. Out from there at once. Hey, how did you know I was under here? <laughs> I can see your feet sticking out from under the bed. Well, that's painfully obvious. Your feet is sticking out. Oh man, and I thought this would have been a great hiding spot. Well, you should have stuck your, you should have completely stuck yourself under the bed, and then Catherine would not have noticed you. Well, enough games now, Mister. It's time for your afternoon nap. So come out from under there at once. Never. I will never come out from under here, you fool. If you do not come out from under that bed, then I will just have to drag you out from under there myself. Oh, bite me. You entitled Karen. Right. Entitled Karen. Visit, <laughs> I am going to give you five seconds to come out from under there, and if you don't, then I am throwing away all your Barney merchandise. Oh. What? Oh no 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 no. Oh wait, hang on. Real random mod just wrote something. And I gotta read it. So I was originally going to have Catherine drag Dave out from under the bed, but I couldn't make Dave go in front of Catherine, and still. And still make it look like he was under the bed. So yeah, that part was a pain to animate. Okay. No water. Don't throw away my Barney merchandise, you evil witch. I can't believe you would even consider doing something so cruel beyond words. Please do, because he's way too old for Barney. Well, if you don't want anything to happen to your beloved Barney merch, then I suggest you stop messing about and come out from under the bed right now. Okay, okay, I'll do whatever you say. Just please, don't throw away my Barney merchandise. There, that wasn't so difficult, was it? No, Mom. And now, it is time for your nap. So come on, and no more messing about this time. Well, guess I'm going to have to accept my fate. And now here is the result of what happens when I tried to do the scene with Catherine dra dragging Dave out of the bed, out from under the bed. Let's see what happens. <laughs> She's pulling Dave out of the bed. <laughs> okay, so that's that's the part that was difficult for her to animate. Okay. Alright. Very funny ending. <laughs> that's the ending I was expect I, I, I wanted to see that ending anyways. But yeah, anyways. That's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed these hilarious childish dad videos. Thank you for watching. Goodbye. <laughs>